my god. Oh, your headlamp's on. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. It's a little chilly this morning. For sure. How was your uh, day at the albergue? How was a day at the albergue? Well, I mean, it was nice. It was a whole day, yeah. yeah it, was, it, was it was a whole day, honestly, because we got there at what time? 11? 11. And uh, we we took our we took our showers and we had a siesta, and then we went out and had dinner and then came back. Huh? Well, actually, we went to sleep. It just it was nice and clean. It's a beautiful albergue. It's probably one of the I've seen. All of them look nice. I feel we haven't seen any that weren't. This is this town. We stayed in the albergue right before town, and so we're just now walking through because there was no way we were going to do it yesterday. And there's some kind of a picture over there or a mural. I can't really see what it is. Hmm. Looks like a baby and a mama. Hmm. Anyway, we're going to go through this town and then five miles before the next All right. I took a picture of the name and I still don't remember what the name said. Do you? Town. Or uh, Albergo de Renero. Okay. This is a wide street and it's kind of a quiet little sleepy town again. Maybe it wakes up in the daytime. First town, four and a half miles. Another sunrise. Here comes the sun. I say. There's rows of trees, rows and rows of trees. I'm telling you, I, this is the only place I've ever seen big trees for firewood and rows. I guess it's the most, you know, I guess it's the easiest and the best way to do it. I don't know. They weren't trying to make a forest for us. <laughs> We're just trying to get some kind of wood. I don't know if it's for fire or to look like they were are so interesting though it's pretty it's a nice beautiful uh, forest floor in there it's got nice grass growing it's nice Let's see what we have over here oh, interesting interesting We are. We think we're in our city. <laughs> we're in the city. We are. It's so cute. It's adorable. Look at that. Look at that. So cute. Look at how far. Look at how pretty that is. That's what we saw too. That's the city. Because we saw that little. It's not always sunshine and roses on the Camino. We arrived at our albergue early to secure a bottom bunk today. And rest before dinner. We covered about 16 point four miles, and reached the town of Manzilla de las Mulas, checking in at El Jardín del Camino. The accommodation was fully booked. My husband and another elderly lady were there early as well, and all the bottom bunks were taken as 25 to 30 people were coming in after we checked in. There was no one in the bottom bunks at all, but the owner told me that they were safe for the infirmed people. But when they arrived, there were 40 to 50 year old men who were just slow hikers. Good morning. In fact, it's like three miles, I think. Not quite three, I think. Not sure. Whew. Oh, this is a bigger. Oh, it's a big river. I didn't even know it. Look at that. And then there's a big bridge over there. 
I didn't know it was a big river. Did you? Well, it's kind of hoppy, but maybe it has a stiff underneath, like over there. I don't know. It's hard to know. But it's pretty, for sure. It's an actual plant. Kind of looks like creeper. It's real. Oh, it's a real. Oh. Okay. That is cool. It has to be real. But a shirt. Look at even. Look at this. Looks like creeper. That looks like. Oh my gosh. Okay, I'm recording this, but I can't, I can't believe it. And there's some ivy. There's ivy. Maybe that's why they were on sale. Maybe they were... Ooh, look at these. Look at these lions. Ceramics. Ooh. Wow. Yeah, it's very cute. I like this town. This is a cute town. Mm -hmm. I'm just noting how the graffiti isn't as beautiful as this one's pretty. But as it was earlier. Whew. Here's a cheetah print. Ooh, this is interesting. It's cute. Bread and hamon. <laughs> this looks a little iffy. Like we're going on the freeway. Then we go onto this bridge and then we go across over that way but yeah that was i'm like i don't want to go against traffic on the freeway <laughs> okay just kidding we're going straight <laughs> not gonna go across that we're gonna go well, i'm straight. thinking this is leon and we're about two miles from our well beer gay but this is a big city <laughs> Um, I thought we were in the outskirts of it, so I'm not quite sure. Like, I don't know. Are we walking through it? I don't know. We'll see when we get there, I guess. But yeah, interesting. It's enormous. Look at it. Look at all the big buildings. There's a beautiful big cathedral there, I see. Yeah, it's a beautiful big city. Oh, It's a school. They have basketball courts, soccer. Gonna be walking through towns the rest of the way, but look. Okay. People make me laugh. <sighs> oh, these are newer buildings. Newer buildings. Ooh, that's an old one. Probably just made everybody really dizzy. Oh, there's another girl on the ground. Tells us to go that way, unless it's a store who's trying to make us go and buy stuff. <sighs> oh, really? That looks like a tiny pot, but it's like six foot tall. <laughs> that guy's walking by it. All right, and then this is probably another Pilgrim's Cross. And yeah, we're walking by it. And a water. There's always a water flowing, like a natural spring flowing. I tell you, you can drink if you want, but it's not chlorinated, so if your body's not used to the water. Oh, there's a bunch of kids. Oh, they're not recording. That's not cool. But over here, another one of those brick bridges, which is so pretty. So pretty. It's very pretty. Oh, here it comes. Yeah, we know who. Yeah, hopefully they keep going. They keep going. So here's a KFC. This is the whole reason why we're staying at this albergue because Roger 
wanted KFC. But look over there. You can tell the story of the original KFC. But then there's a Popeye. There's Popeye's. And there's a McDonald's somewhere around there. There's supposed to be a McDonald's, but we don't really care about McDonald's. But yeah. I wonder how the fries taste. I wonder if they taste the same as the fries that, you know, that they cook a different type of fry, for sure. I mean, they're better. Actually, I like them better, just like a potato. They cut up and they fry them in olive oil. I think it's olive oil. It's definitely not seed oil. So it tastes so good. It tastes so much, oh my gosh, why doesn't everybody cook their fries like that? But anyway. So yeah, we had a crazy day yesterday, so maybe we'll talk about it later. <laughs> it, was, it was crazy. That's all I have to say. It's the only time I've been upset. I have not been upset the whole time. Not at, unless I was mad at Roger. No, that's not true. But yeah, um, should we tell them the story? Not yet. We'll tell the story. We'll get down to tell the story. This is our hostel for the day. It's called Chicken Leon. It's cute. So we're eating at KFCs. And we might go get a piece of Popeyes later and see how it is. Pear. I haven't started the chicken yet. Have you bit the chicken yet? This is in. Oh. And we there were no bottom bunks when we went into our the last room that was left. We tried to find another place to stay in town, but everything was booked. We ended up sleeping on the kitchen floor on the bed liners after dark. I found it too painful to try to climb onto that. It was a very rickety metal bed. We opted for private rooms after this. The next day we stayed at check-in in Lyon, which was spacious and much more comfortable and full of amenities than most other albergues. We even met Hank with an E from the Netherlands again. We really did have a really great night that night. It really redeemed our um, efforts and feelings from the day before. But even with all that, it was still another wonderful day on the Camino.